In order to provide assistance to the residents affected by Typhoon Guring in Barangay Nalasin and Lipay, the residents collaborated to attach ropes to transport the donated food and water essentials required in the area. It has been two days since the two barangays were isolated following the impact of Typhoon Guring. According to Nalasin Barangay Captain Noriel Pascual, despite having received family food packs from various agencies, they are uncertain how long these supplies will last. They are also unsure when their situation will improve, especially since the water flow in the river is still strong and there is no confirmation on when the damaged bridge will be repaired. It's not clear because we don't have to go to the village. Because we went to the village with the village of the council earlier, we went to the village of the Mangri 5A and 5B. Kung sakaling maglagay kami ng temporary daanan pero malakas pa ang ako, sir. Aside from Barangay Nalasin and Lipay, a school in Barangay Dalasdas is also appealing for help. Their school was submerged in flood waters due to the typhoon. The teachers are facing a significant challenge in rebuilding their school as they have not yet completed repairing the damages left by previous typhoon Egay. Eh, nung Martes po nagsimula na po kaming magklase sana, kaya lang dahil sa medyo masama-sama naman yung panahon, medyo na suspendido yung klase, eh, di namin akalain na ganito na naman ang mararat na namin ngayon. Around 11 a.m., the water flow in Barangay de Rasdas gradually subsided. The flooding at the school has also receded, leaving behind thick and sticky mud. The textbooks and several school items were damaged, which is adding to the difficulties the teachers are currently facing. Uh, sana po uh, agarang uh, pagtulong po ang kailangan ng paaralan namin para naman po sa ganun makabango at matuloy po yung pag-aaral ng mga estudyante po namin, yung mga mag-aaral po namin. In, lalo na po sa mga batang nag-aaral dito, gustong gusto, excited na po silang pumasok. Kaya po humihingi po kami ng tulong sa kinauukulan na sana yung agarang uh, tulong talaga ang uh, may bibigay po sa amin. Kasi marami pong nasirang gamit, wala na pong natirang mga aklat, ganun din po yung mga, yung mga printer, mga laptop, mga ano po na gagamitin sana namin sa Bagyong Egay pa noon. Eh ngayon na naman po, sir. Alan Manansala, UNTV News and Rescue. We serve the people, we give glory to God.